Hello, welcome. In this video, I'm going to walk you through how to read about fuel economy on electric, hybrid, and non-hybrid vehicles as they're presented here on this chart. And I suggest you take some time to look at this. I'll share a link to the PDF so you can make sense of it on your own. But what I will do here is I will go through the questions with you, at least most of them, and I'll leave one or two for you to do on your own. So there's a graph here that I've set up and I've added grid lines to their chart to help you read all of this. That's why there's these grid lines here. In this case, the grid lines line up on the right side of the graph with the gasoline cost per, per dollar, uh, gasoline cost per mile. So that's lining up on that right hand side. It doesn't line up on the left because that's about electricity cost per kilowatt hour. It doesn't line up exactly because that's a completely different scale than the scale over here. So for the first couple of questions, we're going to focus on the right-hand side. And in question one, at 270 per gallon, we want to know what would it cost per mile to drive a vehicle with a fuel efficiency of 18 miles per gallon. What's that all about? Well, let's just find out the answer, then we'll explain it. Here's 270. You follow it along until you reach the red dashed line. That's the vehicle that has 18 miles per gallon of fuel efficiency, and they've converted that to energy cost per mile. So it's about, you can see it's about 15 cents, right in the middle of 14 and 16. So per mile, the, the cost of energy per mile for that car is 15 cents per mile. So I'm going to put 0.15. Then we look at the more efficient car, 22 miles per gallon. Now we've increased, we've increased the cost of gas by 80 cents, 80 cents per gallon. So that's going up quite a bit. But we've also increased the fuel efficiency, and now we can see the impact of that on the vehicle and the cost, the energy cost per mile. So with a 350 cost, we follow it over here. Here is the more efficient car, we follow it down, and our cost is only going up to 16 cents, a penny. Think about that, right? It's gone up uh, by a penny from 15 to 16, so now it's 0.16. And even though the cost has gone up 8 cents per, per gallon, our fuel efficiency has gone up by 4 miles per gallon, and that's only risen the energy cost per mile by a single penny. Then we go to question 3. Assuming gas costs $3 per gallon, how much more would the energy cost per mile be on a non-hybrid with an 18 mile per gallon fuel efficiency than a hybrid electric vehicle? So we go here. We go to three dollars per gallon. Here is three. So and I, what did I compare that to? I compared it with the 18 mile. Okay, so three dollars. We look here. It's about 17 cents. And we travel over. Here is the HEV. Uses a combination of electric and gasoline. That's about seven cents. So we go from 17 to seven. That's a 10 cent difference per mile. So every mile you drive that that hybrid electric vehicle, you're saving a dime. Then we go down here to question four. Now we're going over to the electricity side of the graph. So I'm going to click this. And we're looking at the left-hand side now. You have to charge your car up, your electric car. So you have to pay for the electricity that you use to charge your car. So we're looking at this side. What is the cost per kilowatt hour to charge the cars? So if it's 18 cents per kilowatt hour, we want to know how would the cost of energy, how much would the cost of energy per mile be on an EV3 vehicle? EV, so you see EV2, EV3, EV4, the 2, 3, and 4 tell you how many miles you can get per kilowatt hour. So the higher the number, the more efficient the electric vehicle. EV is for electric vehicle. So again, we're looking at 18 cents per kilowatt hour. And here's EV3. There it is. 6 cents. So it's 0.06. And I'll leave the last question to you. Um, you're comparing the EV3 to the EV4 vehicle. Thank you.